Hi, I'm Sky from TLC Plumbing, Heating, and Cooling. We're here today to talk about these two things and why you should throw this one away. I'm going to tell you why you should never use a plunger to unclog a toilet. Sound silly? A plunger is messy and only capable of clearing a clog within the toilet itself. If the clog or obstruction is in the drain line underneath the toilet, then using a plunger can cause the wax ring at the toilet space to move or break. If you cause a wax ring to break on a second floor restroom, it will flood through to the rooms below. Or cause a slow leak that will eventually cause the same thing, just slower until the ceiling starts to bubble or water starts to come through. If you have a single story home, the water will flood under the floor and stay trapped under the toilet itself. Water trapped under the toilet will cause the flange that holds the toilet to rust or deteriorate. If you have any problems with a wax ring located at the base of your toilet, you'll typically start to notice some movement or rocking within the toilet, or even staining or discoloration of the floor or the tiles below. So what is the solution when you have a toilet clog? A closet auger is the correct tool to use for the job. The closet auger can extend past the bends of the toilet to reach the main line, taking care of issues that the plunger cannot reach. A closet auger can push an obstruction through into the main drain, or actually retrieve something that's been flushed down through the toilet, such as keys or toys flushed by a small child. There's a price difference between the plunger and closet auger. A closet auger typically runs approximately $60 at any home improvement store. Although a plunger is less expensive than the closet auger, it may not be worth it in the long run if you break the wax ring on the toilet. If you're interested in learning more or have questions, call us today or visit us online at tlcplumbing.com.